Welcome back, everyone. Today is Super Tuesday. Republicans will be holding nominating contests in 15 states, Democrats in 15 states, and one territory. Joining us to talk about this is Committee of 70 President and CEO Lauren Christella. Good morning, Lauren. Good morning. Thanks so much for having me. Our pleasure. So how important is uh, this day for the race for the White House overall? It's a big day. It's not going to fully lock up the nomination for either of the top candidates. But uh, it is make or break for Nikki Haley, right? There's a lot of delegates up for grabs today. And uh, it would make the road for her to, to win the nomination basically impossible if she doesn't lock up uh, quite a few today. So, Lauren, what should we be watching for today as the voting progresses and the day progresses? We're certainly watching Nikki Haley and the moves that she's making. I think she spent the most she spent throughout the campaign on, on today's primaries. Uh, we're also watching some down ballot races. There's competitive uh, races in California for Dianne Feinstein's Senate seat. Uh, there's a, a race in North Carolina for governor that should be very competitive and a new map in Alabama that, uh, that we'll be watching the, the results of too. I mean, it's really, in, for, as far as the presidential race, wouldn't you say it's kind of anticlimactic? I mean, for years, I used to always look forward to Super Tuesday and see, you know, if someone would suddenly come out of the back of the pack. That's not happening this year. I mean, I don't need a crystal ball to figure that one out. It's true. The, the top candidates, former President Trump and President Biden, seem very much to be the likely nominees. They're not going to wrap that up until about March 12th or March 19th, mm -hmm. as far as delegate counts go. Uh, but, but that... Uh, that kind of inevitability is also leading to some voter apathy, we think, as well. Hmm. And Lauren, also, you know, we know that our primary is coming up on April 23rd here in Pennsylvania. So this is Super Tuesday for 15 other states. Uh, what kind of an impact do you see this having on the Pennsylvania primary coming up? I know some people will think that their vote doesn't matter. Uh, and the, the, the delegates may be decided by April 23rd. But there are some important races here, our attorney general race, top uh, statewide statewide offices so definitely worth casting your vote uh, and Pennsylvania has closed primaries so you need to pick a party by April mm -hmm. 8th the deadline to be able to vote in our primary on the 23rd. Lauren Costello from the Committee of 70 thanks so much for joining us this morning Lauren. Thanks so much for having me. Well, we do have some dates for our local primaries for you again. Delaware is April 2nd, followed by Pennsylvania, April 23rd, and New Jersey's primary election is June 4th. Stay with CBS News Philadelphia for continuing coverage, of course, throughout these primaries and the entire 2024 presidential election.